morning you guys welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is mink and of course this is minx kinks don't mind all of this y'all as you clicked on the title today we are getting into a travel vlog so it is going to be 72 hours in florida so i am still at home obviously um and it is the morning of let me grab my phone so right now as you guys can see it is 10 o'clock i need to be out of here by 12 30 but um i don't know if it's just me or not but i just can't leave my house a mess when i'm going on a trip so i am cleaning my kitchen right now i need to finish packing up my suitcase so here is my suitcase here and then i did some laundry so i just need to put away the rest of my laundry get dressed i have my candle burning um i want to make up my bed and all of those things and then yeah we're gonna head out of here so um oof. It's going to be a fun weekend. I'm not sure um, what else I'll film while I'm at home, but get ready because this vlog is about to be a good time. All right, babies, we are back. And as y'all can see, I am dressed and everything and ready to go. First of all, I got a new plant. His name is Oscar. I don't think you guys have met him yet, but that's Oscar. Oscar Fernando. Um, here's my suitcase. Is it a big suitcase for three days? Absolutely. But I plan on going shopping while I'm there. <laughs> y'all know and then i have this little bag for my carry-on it has my laptop my book my headphones all my electronic chargers just in case i get stuck a layover or anything like that it is a straight flight to um orlando i told you guys i'm going to florida but we're going to orlando so that's where we're going um my aunt is already there so i'm getting ready to head to the airport so yeah you guys i will see you guys when i get there well, I'm going to try and get some footage in the car. Y'all already know me, but y'all know I have a car tripod, so that'd be... I'll see y'all when I get there, y'all. So I made it hey. to Florida. We're here with Simply. <laughs> and we already stopped and got liquor from not one but two places. Okay. So today we have our little little patron Pat for later. Room. Pat Ron, if you will. Oh, she looks like she's going to a fiesta. Fiesta. But what I came on camera to show y'all is these little shots. If my camera focus, hold on. <laughs> Strawberry Sunday, 20% alcohol. Yeah. She's not gonna try one though, cause she's been drinking all day. But I have been drinking. I have not. So I feel like I should take two and do one for my Instagram story as well. So this is what it looked like. Um it is strawberry vodka with artificial flavor Trash. and vanilla. Alright, cheers. Oh, it smells good, though. Nah, hold on. Yeah, it smells like alcohol. <laughs> you take them and let me know how it goes. <laughs> it smells like alcohol. You trying to trick okay. me up. Well, I don't think I could do the whole thing, but. Come on, baby. You got some man up. My birthday. Oh. I wasn't. Hmm. It really wasn't bad. I take hmm. your word. I get it again. It wasn't what bad at all. What does it taste like? Mm. Vanilla. You could taste the vanilla more than the strawberry. What would you compare it to? Um, for this to be twenty percent, it doesn't taste like alcohol. Though. The vanilla tastes like melted McDonald's ice cream with a splash of vodka. When the machine works. When the machine is operating. All right, you guys so i figured i'd hop on here and do a cute little voiceover the restaurant the vibe was so so cute but i had to hop on here and tell y'all the drinks uh, uh the drinks were not it this is the drink right here it was the presentation was super super cute and the food was delicious but the drinks were just they were just nasty like we had to send them back type nasty y'all and of course this whole vlog y'all gonna get the views because y'all know i'm a views girl hey y'all so so i am back and we are literally in a hotel because let me tell y'all we are absolutely drunk 
so um my aunt got here she got here um earlier in a day and then she came and picked me up from the airport and um we've been drinking ever since um sorry y'all i know i probably look a mess on camera because honestly in reality i'm a mess like right now i'm i'm, I'm drunk for real um we went to a restaurant i will insert the name of the restaurants i'm not 100 percent sure of it off the top of my head um we got what was it crab rolls i'm pretty sure we got crab rolls um they were pretty good they needed a little sauce so we put ranch on them the fries were top tier but um both of the drinks we had were very lackluster very pretty presentation but the drink itself just wasn't hitting um you know so yeah tomorrow we're going to go to brunch we're going to do some shopping it'll just be a good time um y'all there's something in my eye so i keep picking up my eye but yeah we're getting ready for bed and everything hence the bonnet y'all know my hair is in a puff so it's huge right now but yeah so that's the update right now but um my aunt's birthday is on sunday so it's litty city all weekend and then we do go back home monday morning so and uh, y'all let me tell you about this plan right real quick so um come to find out there's all these um cheer shows and family type events um going on this weekend we saw a bunch of aka's as well so apparently there's a lot going on this weekend we had no idea so um we're definitely kind of in the mix um and that's not necessarily what we wanted but we're definitely in the mix right now y'all don't get on my skin i am breaking out and i just don't know why besides the point but yeah so um there's a lot of kids right now let me show you the view from our room because it's actually beautiful so this is our view and there's a handful of people still down there but for the most part it is cleared out so yeah y'all for the rest of the night um i'm about to take a shower she's in the shower right now and then i'll take a shower i'm gonna go to bed and we'll start this day over tomorrow we're gonna go to brunch um and then like i said we have some other things to do so i will see y'all in the oh i was telling y'all about my flight hello so yeah as for the flight um i told you guys there was a bunch of um like cheer competitions and stuff and i don't know if that's what those kids were for but um or you know orlando is just disney disney central so i don't know if it was just the kids spring breaks and all of that i don't know when i tell y'all kids everywhere okay um i'm talking running up and down y'all know when y'all go to the airport it's not um a lot of space for your designated flight um so just imagine like three four maybe eight year old girls running up and down the um that little area y'all i was getting so annoyed because where are your parents that was something but the flight itself wasn't that bad it was a little bumpy getting up because it was um raining pretty hard when i came to the airport so it was a little rocky coming up but smooth landing got here in one piece which is all i can ask for so um yeah it wasn't that bad and this was my first time flying by myself so it worked out pretty well so yeah y'all i feel like i've done enough talking i will see you guys in the morning Good morning vlog. Today is Saturday. Simply's birthday. Pre-birthday. So pre-birthday. Her birthday's tomorrow. But it's a pre-game today. So we're dressed, we're ready. Um, we have breakfast reservations at 10, 10 30. Oh, we're not going. So um, we're going to the Gucci store. We do know that. Um, love that for us. Go do a little shopping. Oh, I guess I could give you guys a little LLTD. So this is what I'm wearing today. Just a little sundress. Tan. And then my purse. Thank you. Um, here is my purse. So...
guys so i hate how loud the music was and i didn't even think about it so i have to drop in and do another voiceover so this is in the same area where that like dave and busters-esque type area was at so this section that we found it has a ferris wheel it has um that arcade situation and then it also has an aquarium and a madame tucson um wax museum so that's what we came to do but it was starting to rain and everything so we decided to hold off which you guys will see later in the vlog good morning you guys so today is day three of our trip and um, today is Shantaju's birthday so when you watch your kids in a happy birthday um so today we're about to go do something to eat we're gonna go ride the ferris wheel hit up another mall show y'all what i got when i get home dinner oh we're getting a massage today too so today should be a fun day yesterday was also fun we also have more fun left over so yeah y'all also, let's talk about Zara. Um, I have seen quite a few people talk about Zara as if like it gives. And we went into one here, and it's giving very much bougie H and You know what I'm saying? Like it didn't give. It didn't give what I thought it was gonna give. Like even the H and M next door looked pretty much the same. So I'm just a little bit confused. Um, so let me know down below what y'all think about that because lighthearted. It's heartbreaking. It's powerful. It's it's real. This is your home. Happy birthday! Blue, blue, blue. <laughs> we just got a massage. That was a call. Thanks to Shantager finding the group on. So we're on our way to the mall, and then we're gonna go to uh, um, the wheel. The wheel. Well, it's more than just the. It's the Ferris wheel. There's a um, wax museum, and then the aquarium. So. And it's like a Dave and Buster inside there. Yeah, it definitely is giving very much Dave, Dave and Buster. It's mm -hmm. very, very much gamey. Um. Out of here. So yeah, it'll be a fun day for oh, sure. Get up. Turn left <laughs> onto West or Boulevard. <laughs>
women and fit your men And some little girls sell their souls because of sin Look at where you be in, head weaves like Europeans Fake niggas done by Koreans, come again And it's Tim's and it's women, him and it's men Come in the club like hooligans, don't care who they your fan Poppin' yang, you got yang Let's stop pretend, the one the back pissed out by the waist man Chris out by the case man, still the name of the space It's a pretty face man, claiming that they did a bit man Need to take care of their three and four kids Men just facing court case when the child supports late Hey you guys, so obviously I have made it back home Thank God Um, And yeah, it's actually like 9 o'clock so y'all we had a super super early morning flight we were at the airport at three this morning so it was just a really really early morning um after we got back i went to starbucks i took a nap i washed my hair i filmed and now i'm finally getting around to unpacking and i just wanted to quickly show you guys what i got while on a trip y'all know <laughs> i'm a shopaholic so of course we did some shopping so let's just do that real quick first up marshall's so the first thing that I picked up from Marshalls was actually these candles and we saw them in the back and they were on clearance but look at these. Like get into these candles and I actually picked these up because these go super nice with my um, artwork in the living room so I figured that this would be perfect. And then the second thing that I spotted was another mug. Yes, in my last vlog, I bought another mug but look at this one. So the mug actually says Mimi. And if you guys don't know, I have a ton of nicknames and Mimi is one of one of them, one of my favorite, one of the most common, well Mimi's definitely my favorite and definitely the most common. Um, and I never find anything that actually says Tamiya so when I saw this it felt like Destiny honey and it's just so freaking cute. A little bottle of Patron because we never um, used it so you know, hello. All right, so and then we went to the Ugg store and this is where we hit a lick, honey. So from the Ugg store, we went in there. It was an Ugg outlet and y'all, y'all know that I just have really small feet. So I am able to fit kids and women's shoes. So I wear a, a like five or six in women's. It honestly depends on the shoes. And then I'm able to fit the bigger sizes in kids. Um, and we came up on these super cute little Ugg rock rain boot situation and it has the sock insert in there uh, uh huh and guess how much i paid for these y'all 35 dollars i paid 35 dollars for these and i feel like i'm gonna wear these all the time i just think they are so cute so so cute and if you know you know i like to have my shoe boxes and yeah i finessed it into my suitcase i did all right so before we get into the clothes i did go ahead and pick up these hair ties we had to run into walmart and i've never seen these and i don't know this feels perfect for like a low puff situation or even my buns so yeah i'm excited about these so from h&m i only got two things um the first thing that i found were these just regular regular black shorts they were only five dollars so of course i went ahead and picked them up i don't have any black shorts so next we went to victoria's secret pink and i actually picked up their little skims dupe and i honestly picked it up because it's such a nice lightweight material this was also on clearance this was only 25 dollars for the for the set together um, and I really like the blue color. You guys know I work from home so I like to have those like comfort type of outfits. I do have some skims but when I find a good skims dupe you know I'm going to pick it up. Next we did also hit up an old navy and for whatever reason green was the color of this trip. So I just picked up these um, like tealish color. Hopefully they're coming up a little bit better on camera. But these little sweatpants I just thought they were really cute. They fit really well and they're really nice material it's not too hot it's not too cold but i feel like i'll be able to wear these both in the summertime and in the winter um i like that it has like the drawstring i really like these old navy did they did something with this one we ended up using a coupon with that 
and we both got a pair so yeah and then last but not least y'all we actually went to a forever 21 now i can't tell y'all the last time i've been in a forever 21 but i did find some things so the first thing that i found were these cargoes and these are very cute y'all so y'all know i've been trying to find a pair of cargoes i bought some from amazon at one point those were too big i ordered them again they were too small you know just too much going on um but these ones from forever 21 are actually really good they were um 34.99 and i got them in a large but i'm actually going to order when i get off the camera yeah when i get off the camera i'm going to go ahead and order these online because i want them in an extra large so they have that more baggier feel y'all know i got a big butt you know i'm carrying a wagon in the back and um sometimes it just doesn't end up fitting the way i want it to so i'm going to order the extra large because i know that that's going to give the more baggy streetwear type look that i want it to to give next i picked up this little t-shirt this was 12.99 it says be strong be brave be fearless you are never alone and it says joshua 1 9 i don't know y'all i just thought this little shirt was so cute and i love what it says um i y'all know i love a t-shirt i mean need i say more all right y'all and then the last but not least y'all know i love a graphic tee now the t-shirts yes i wear t-shirts all the time all summer all winter all year round okay but a graphic t-shirt you can tell me absolutely nothing about a graphic t-shirt i love graphic t-shirts i have a whole drawer dedicated to graphic t-shirts and i don't have a prince one and i've been looking for a good prince one but all the good print like the prince ones are always the purple rain album cover and it's in black and i don't want that i've had a shirt like that i didn't want that so i ended up finding this in white come on like come on i just thought this was so freaking cute um i love the glitter y'all know <laughs> y'all know baby girls a girly girl okay and i love the blue glitter that it gave i i just love it i love that it's in white i love the picture i love that it almost gives like a little old school like spray paint situation i love it um i'm gonna tell y'all though the t-shirt was 22 dollars, and i was like girl we're at forever 21 but I did go ahead and get it because honestly, I didn't spend that much this whole trip other than chow on food. So um, I did really, really good, y'all. So thank you guys so, so much if you made it to the end of this video. I do have a lot of things planned this um, summer and later on this year. I'm really, really excited. Shout out to Sean Tatura. Happy birthday to you. I hope that you enjoyed your trip. I know that I did, okay? So yeah, y'all, I hope that you enjoyed this travel vlog. Let me know some other things you want to see down below. I love you guys and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.